So here's my 2023 Subaru Impreza hatchback and I've done a few modifications on it. There's a video on that of the first mods that I put on the car, but I ordered a rear bumper diffuser. So here's what the back end looks like right now. I do have the nameless quad tip exhaust, which looks awesome, but I needed something to kind of break up that bumper there. So I ordered the diffuser. We're going to put it on. All right, so here is the box variant arrow. It's all packaged really nice in there. So we've got to open it up, see what's in there. These are private side ones. And then you got one main guy right there with some brackets. And there's the main setup right there. One middle one and then you can set those off to the side. Here's all the stuff we need. Let's get into it. All right, instructions say jack up the rear only for lower cars, which I'm not lowered, so I should be able to get under it. And basically, we're gonna put these brackets onto the heat shield of the um, exhaust. So they give you a little picture of what it should look like and then those eventually will go into the holes here. There's two right here. So the bolt right here, there's one right here. So that's where the brackets are gonna go. Okay, so here's how I have the bracket here. I did have to bend this part a little bit, but you can see it's screwed in right there. And then you got your loose piece right here. So we just have to do this bolt right here and do the same thing. Again, so here's the bracket. So I flip it over like this and just push on it. Just a little bit there just to kind of get it to flatten out like that. And then it's gonna go backside like that. And then it'll hang out just like that. So then they give you a bag with two bolts and washers like so. So you're gonna end up uh, putting them up through these holes right here and then screw it in to right here. Then this way the, the brackets bend so you can kind of push it back to line it up where you need it. And then you got your screws. You're good to go. All right, now that you have the middle section complete, it's time to move on to the sides. Grab your right spat and line it up the way you want. This part of the install is completely up to you, however aggressive you want it. Once you line it up where you want, screw a self-tapping screw into it. Use about six screws, repeat on the left, and you're done. Which one's the right one? These aren't labeled. Might have to look up some pictures. A few moments later. Okay, so this one's the right one. I'm using this body panel line. And you kind of line that up there. And then this way you could bring it up as to front it up with those. And it's going to stick out a little bit on this bumper here. You don't want it too close to the exhaust tip. So you kind of you kind of play where you want to put it. It's also going to block a little bit of the uh, mud flap there. But... That one will be like that. And then this one here. All right, that works.
say the install is done. Maybe it took about half hour, 40 minutes just because of uh, <laughs> some tools I had to get. Um, but yeah, went together fairly well. The instructions were nice. This is what it looks like. Nice overall, pretty fun install. I got a bonus install right here. I picked up one of these, a little King Boo to hang from one of my handles in the car. So we're gonna install that right now. guys there's the full rear diffuser installed again it didn't take very long at all to put it on just getting the right tools and getting those screws in awkward positions laying down on the ground but I think it puts the back end a little more aggressive they have different angles that you can get mine are more I guess curved you can say but they have a more aggressive look or more swooping I'll give a link in the description where I picked up the diffuser, but it's a nice little mod for the Subaru. Be sure to let me know some other things maybe I should do to the Subaru, and if you haven't seen the full mod video, there'll be a link in the description as well. Okay guys, as always, I'm Russ Lyman, and keep your world fun bit by bit. I'll see you next video.